the Don't Fade channel, checking in with an extremely, and I do mean extremely quick review of Boston's Museum of Science newest temporary exhibit, Body Worlds, Circle of Life. So because this is going to be such a quick review, I'm going to tell you now, hit that like button and of course hit that subscribe button. If you are not familiar with Body Worlds, Circle of Life, it is not a new exhibit in general. It is an old exhibit going back probably 12 to 14 years that has since circled the country, circled the world, and has tons of different iterations. Um, but all of the exhibits are essentially the same in that they take donated bodies and they preserve them using a process. I believe it's called plasterization. I'm probably getting that wrong, but they take plastics to preserve the body in all of their true form. If you haven't already seen a Body Worlds exhibit, then I would highly recommend you get down to the Museum of Science before this exhibit ends on January 5th and take it in. It is certainly educational, it's certainly a thing to behold, and it is certainly something you want to go through and see at least once if you haven't already seen one of these exhibits regarding Body Worlds before. I will say it takes about um, 45 to 60 minutes because I have already seen one of these in a previous iteration. I went through it with my wife in about 40 minutes, but certainly give yourself an hour. Don't rush it. In terms of cost, if you remember, that's obviously the cheapest way to see um, this exhibit, and it only costs $7 for members. I, I can't say it enough. I highly recommend being a Museum of Science member. It pays for itself on the second visit, and that's not just just garbage. That's That's just math. It certainly pays for itself on your second visit. If you are not already a member of the Museum of Science and don't plan on becoming a member of the Museum of Science, you can buy uh, standalone admission passes to Body Worlds without having to purchase a full entrance into the Museum of Science. So that's one way to save you just a little bit of money. I'll put the pricing on the screen right now. Overall, Boston's Museum of Science Body Worlds exhibit is definitely one you want to take in before it ends January 5th, 2020. Um, it's not only educational for you, but if you have children probably over the age of 10, they would get a lot out of it. Not only just seeing um, skeletons and muscles, but seeing how it all goes together with respect to the different internal organs and the different systems. I'm not doing it justice, and clearly my camera with regards to the lighting inside the Body Worlds exhibit isn't doing it justice either. Certainly get yourself there, get down to the Boston Museum of Science and take this exhibit in. If you came this far in the video, hey, give this video a like. If you have any questions regarding um, Body World Circle of Life exhibit, drop them in the comments below and I will try, try, try my best to answer them for you. As usual, thanks for watching and don't save anything for the trip back. I am dedicated to helping you dads be great parents to your children and still accomplish your own personal goals. I post tips and tricks to save you dads time, energy, and money. Three things that are in short supply for every dad out there.